welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey hi hello welcome my name is Lauren I make lifestyle and self-help videos here on YouTube today's video is going to be a cleaning routine I'm gonna be showing you guys how I keep the kitchen clean what me and my roommates do to make sure everything is spick and span and also some of my favorite cleaning products Hey guys, as mentioned before, today's video is my kitchen cleaning routine. I'm excited to share with you all this video because the last one I did was over a year ago in my old apartment, so I thought, let's give them an updated one. You guys really seem to like that video, so I thought I would go ahead and make a new one. Before we hop into the video though, guys, I did want to mention that I will have links down below to some of my favorite cleaning products and things that I use in the video, so if you're interested in checking those out, I will have them in the description box for you guys. Alright guys, we're going to go ahead and get started with cleaning the kitchen. First, I am starting off by putting away any of the clean dishes that are sitting on the dish drying rack. Um, this is typically where these kind of get piled up after a little while, so just tucking everything away where they belong. Baking pans, of course, I kind of try and clean up this little cabinet just a smidge because things are kind of toppling over. Once that's all done, I go and kind of just check out everything that's hanging out on the counter because sometimes food gets expired that's sitting up here or goes bad. So just double checking that anything over in our little corner is straightened up and thrown away. Time to put away some drinks that were left out. This is just simple tidying up, obviously. Anything that's been left out on the counters, I just make sure to put away where they go. Throwing away some junk mail and trash that's just been sitting out for a while. Comment down below if you guys literally have a spot in your apartment where you just collect mail. Also, if you have a junk drawer because this one is so bad. Maybe I'll do a whole video on organizing this. Now it's time to check the dishwasher. This time it was pretty full so I went ahead and popped in a little dish detergent pod so that that would get started and I could empty that later on. Fairly simple here. Next it's time to clean the sink. And this is something I like to do every now and then just because the sink kind of gets grime and dirt built up on it. So I just went in scrubbing it with some regular soap and just making sure all of the gross stuff kind of was, you know, really torn up and off of it because it gets pretty nasty and I like a clean shining sink. I also make sure to get in the little nooks and crannies on the top around the faucet just to get all the gunk that hides back there as well. And I'm finishing it up by going over with a little Clorox wipe to get any leftover bits and pieces and just kind of clean up all the bubbles and get what the little sprayer couldn't. Now it's time to go in with a Clorox wipe and clean off all the counters and surfaces. I like to go and wipe down all of our like coffee machines and appliances that are also hanging out. Normally, I would use a degreaser here on the stove top, but we actually ran out of it, so right now I'm just using a Clorox wipe, which works just as well. Just making sure to get all of the gunk and things that get kind of built up on the counter, because sometimes you don't really see it, and you know, it's just gross, you know, you want to have a nice, clean surface. Here, I'm just going ahead and putting back everything where it belongs. I'm gonna start kind of taking care of and cleaning the little bar top here that we have. Just straightening up some leftover Halloween decorations, putting away things that are on the countertop. I went through my little set of candles here and threw away one or two that were kind of dead or really weren't working anymore and lit the other one so it would be nice and all smelly goodies here in the kitchen. 
Now I'm going to give you guys a little overview of how everything looks. Now it's nice and clean and tidy. We like to do this pretty frequently so that we don't have to do super deep cleans every now and then. And honestly, it's just so nice and welcoming whenever we come home. an entire playlist that I'm going to be keeping all of my cleaning routine videos so if you're needing some cleaning motivation or maybe you're just interested in how I clean my room and my bathroom and all that good stuff I will have those videos put into a playlist so that you guys can watch them in the future and now and binge watch them if you need to Alrighty guys, before we hop into the video though, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. All you have to do is click that little red button right down there so you guys can stay notified whenever I post a new video. Also, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it or you found it motivating, helpful, inspiring, whatever you needed to get from it in order to clean your kitchen or whatever space. Alright guys, let's jump in. Alright guys, that was my kitchen cleaning routine. If you found it interesting, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more. You can click the little red subscribe button right down below. Super duper easy. I also have an entire list of some of my favorite cleaning products and the ones that you guys saw in the video in my description box, so give that a check in case you are wondering what I used. I also have an entire playlist where I will be keeping all of my cleaning routines and the ones that I've done before, so if you're interested in watching more or if you just need a little bit more inspiration or you want to come back later whenever you know you have to clean again. This will be great for you guys, so make sure to go and check that out as well. I really hope you all enjoyed this video though and found it helpful, inspiring, or a little bit motivating. That is going to be the end of this video and I will see you all in my next one. Bye guys!